bendy, by the way. Hello? Is it still closed here? Uh, we just opened. Welcome, come in. Hey, it's you! Bendy, was it? Uh. Dude, chill. But it's me, Felix again, and he remembered my name! Damn it, Bendy, stop being so adorable in this episode, Jesus! Play it cool, Bendy. They have your autograph? Is your new book ready? Is it true that you have a claw mark? Yeah. Would you shut up and let me handle this? Hey, it's you. Felix, was it? <laughs> Just kidding. I already know ya. Don't pull that shit with me, Bundy. I already see it through your mind, fuckery. Huh? Fist pump? He ain't your buddy. Show some respect, damn it! Lay off, dude. Claw mark. Second book, The Lost Letter of Princess Oriana, he got face to face with the fire tiger. While battling it, the tiger managed to hurt Felix very badly. But even with his wound, he came out victorious. Wound got better with time, but it left a permanent mark on him. That's a load of bullshit, and you know it. Stop crushing my dreams! Does Felix actually have the claw mark? So, how can I help you? Oh, um, Miss Betty sent me to ask you if you finished the poster she asked for. Yep, sure did. Oh, Phil, you got something on your face there. Hmm? Let me just... <clears throat> Pay up. Oh. I love this one. He's so cute and just adorable. Oh, gosh. There it is. There it is. He has it. Oh, my God. I really want to read your books now, Felix. <clears throat> well, he does have it. Is that your scar from their fight with the fire Taga? Sure is. So, like, your books are actually about real events? With a little bit of exaggeration, but yeah, most of it is true. <laughs> Bendy, stop distracting me with your cuteness, jeez! Bendy lost his cool now. Let's keep our eyes on the prize, buddy. I mean, look at that kitty's big booty over there. What are you, nuts? What if she's one of Felix's relatives, or his friends, or his girlfriend? <laughs> Cockblocker. Okay, you two are amazing, so I'm giving you nicknames. We're gonna be cool, flirty. And you're gonna be adorable, gentlemen. Wait, where's Boris Cup and Mugs? Hey, Bendy. Betty said I'd find you here. Is everything ready? Yep, I just offered to help her out. After that, we'll be on our way. Wow, am I seeing things, or is that Felix? Don't question it, bro. Everything is real. Oh, Bendy has a crush. Oh, I wouldn't mind going gay for someone like him. Wait, what? Come on, dude, don't take it out of contacts. What can I possibly take in from that, then? <laughs> hey, Bendy, I've noticed some changes in our map. Locations seem to be getting bigger and more clear. You think... That we're getting close? Could be. Let's get a better look when we get back to our room. Just open it here, dude. No one but us can see it anyways. Bendy, Felix can hear you. Yep, it sure looks different. This is clearly near Bulk Mountains. The piece is just around it. This map truly is... Magical! Felix, what the hell? Did you by any chance mean the ink machine piece by the word piece? And this must be the map from above. I can't believe it's real. It really is blank. Or oh, sorry, I got carried away. How did Felix know about the ink machine piece? Bendy, what did I say about being cute? He knows everything. How did you come up with all that, sir? Quite a strange discovery in the town's nearby casino. Let's just say I found a secret message and spent ages decrypting it. Even after that, it seemed risky to tell the whole world such a thing. It's just hard to believe. Not to mention how much of a touchy subject the inkness is. That's why I didn't want to include it in any of my books. Felix, you're smart and you're badass. You are now my idol. Felix is one smart, nerdy cat. I can't believe you're the chosen ones. It must be awesome to feel like heroes. Huh, heroes? Maybe I'm being overly nosy, but you know, I can really offer you guys my help by joining you on this quest. I know the way around Mount Block like the back of my hand. So, what do you say? I would be. <laughs> you excuse us for a sec. Poor Riz, don't crush the Bendy's dreams. Bendy, I... Bro, before you say anything, let me just stop you there. This is Felix we're talking about. He could be a major help to us, and also think. Being on one of his adventures, being there on his side and all the time, just... Uh... Let's just say he's way more experienced and trustworthy than those couplings we so foolishly let on our team. 
It's got a point there, Boris. Think about it. You and Bendy have the map, the cup girl's got strength, and Felix can be the guide. It's a well-balanced team. Well, except for the fact you don't have a nurse or, like, a negotiator. I mean, I don't trust the cup girl's gambling or negotiating skills. That's what caused this whole mess in the first place! That is true. I don't know if he's trustworthy like Bendy said, though. Oh, just a bunch of hypocrites. Hypocrites, I tell ya. Hypocrites. But, meh, whatever makes him happy. 